start by placing two 100k resistors in parallel. The one side is going to be connected to the positive terminal of the breadboard and the other is going to be connected over the middle of the breadboard into row F of the breadboard. Take your LDR, which is your light dependent resistor, and connect it to the resistors, which are in parallel, and the negative terminal of the breadboard. An LDR has no polarity, so that means it does not have a positive nor negative lead, just like a normal resistor. Place your LED in the middle of the breadboard, far away from your LDR. For reasons being, when the circuit is closed, their resistance decreases as the light intensity increases. So we need to have enough space between the LDR and the LED to see this effect. The positive lead of the LED is going into row E of the breadboard and the negative lead is going into row F of the breadboard. Now take your 1K resistor and connect it to the positive lead of the LED and the positive terminal of the breadboard. Now get your transistor and connect the collector of the transistor to the negative lead of the LED. Take a wire and connect the emitter of the transistor to the negative terminal of the breadboard. Take another wire and connect the base of the transistor to the LDR. LDR is a light dependent resistor. A photoresistor or light dependent resistor are light sensitive devices. The resistance of the LDR decreases with the increase in light intensity. Get your 9 volt battery and connect it to the breadboard. The red wire is a positive which should be connected to the positive terminal of the breadboard and the black wire is the negative 
which should be connected to the negative terminal of the breadboard.